Hello again, folk. Happy New Year to you all. Thanks for all the people that subscribe, my regular viewers and the regular people that comment. I know I'm not very good at getting back to you on your comments, like, but I do read them and I do appreciate them. So thank you very much. Uh, it's not a night dig. It's a waiting for it to come light dig. <laughs> Tom's, uh, Tom's over there somewhere. He's trying over there. I just fancied coming. Well, that's, I suppose that's where Tom finished off the other day. So, uh, but this is where I finished off. So, yeah, the usual. You got that eight inch of mud, and then straight into quite nice ash. Uh, a bit barren to start with. It can come and go. I'm coming on with a torch. Is it dog walkers or is it bobbies? <laughs> we will see. Dog walker, I think. One up bank here. I don't know what it is, it's only aqua or clear, so. But we shall see. You never know. It's got writing on anyway. <laughs> Probably some crappy beer. Oh. Haslam, Sutton in Ashfield. With no top. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's just coming light now. Oh, seems to have taken forever this morning. I think it's because it's a bit gloomy. Uh, there's one down there. I don't know if it's a, a beer or a cod. I don't know if it's aqua or coloured. I can't really tell. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh, dear. That's the usual suspect on it. But they're not a bad bottle. Like I said before, they always, they always seem to be a different shade every time you get them, so two or three together, they do look quite good. Have a look, quick clean. Yeah, it's like it'll clean up pretty good. Sadly, the, uh, the water table has uh, rose a bit since last time, which is a shame because uh, it's feels quite packed down here I've not brought my coking fork so oh, so it's going to make it a bit a bit awkward we'll just have to do what we can yeah we'll have quite a bit of rain though to be fair yeah very sloppy you're not <laughs> you don't stay clean when it's like this <laughs> oh well carry on just pulled that one out Greaves and son, chemist Chesterfield. It's okay. That's all right, that. Yeah, cope with that. Carry on. Very gloomy today. It's light, but it's uh, not very light in here. Well. <laughs> I did have a nice chemist bottle, but when going out of the hole, I accidentally kicked it onto onto that and broke it. Clumsy bugger. <laughs> and also the whiskey flask I got the other day, last time I came, I think, Angel Hotel. I managed to do a juggling act with that and drop it on the kitchen floor and all, so. <laughs> I'm doing very well, I'm have to be more careful. Anyway. Yeah, that's basically down to that water. It's, uh, it's a bit awkward down there, but we'll uh, we'll see what we can manage. Just add that one out. Try not to break this one. Furnace and sun. Maybe coming up, but it's one I've not seen. But that's all right. Again, nice and clean. That's all right. <laughs> Little blue. Steady trickler finds. Carry on. Yeah, 
carry on. Back down to back down to soggy stuff again. Just want that one out of the water. I think I know what that is. Oh, I think it's a Mr. TP Wood. That's exactly what it is. TP Wood, Mr. Punch. Not the best struck one I've seen, but it's all right, that. The green bee just dropped out there. I'm not sure what it is. It's a nice colour, mind. F-Homes. Whittington Moor. F-Homes and Sun. What a lovely colour though. Probably got the original stopper in. Maybe, maybe not. Yeah, not bad that. Not bad. Get that one out. Like a TP wood. Yeah. Not bad. Straight out at water. One of the other diggers who's been on. Yeah, yeah. Laddo's just give me that. It's very kind of him. I'm going to chuff with that, seeing as I broke the last one. One for the shelf. Oh, all filled in. Job's a good one. 